let's see. Okay, so we're going to use the turtle module to implement our Roomba algorithm. So each square is 40 by 40 pixels. And okay. the uh, main turtle methods are forward some distance, backward some distance, right some angle, left some angle. Um, optional, if you know what a for loop is, uh, you can use a for loop. Um, let's see, so that's step two. Uh, use the turtle to implement your Roomba algorithm. Uh, to do... So, I, I, I don't think this says... Maybe I skipped the part where it says it, but we want to try last to time, make... Remember when we did the Roomba algorithm last time? Yes. So, we want to make the turtle... Uh, go across every single square, uh, at least once. Okay. Um, so let's go back to the code, which you are still sharing. Um, let's see. Roomba level zero dot pi. So, uh, you would type, um, control x or actually you can you can click on the button for the uh yeah. up at the top be, to the right of the word shell do you see the blank page with a corner folded over to the right of yeah. that there's a button that it looks like a folder that's kind of opening up yeah uh i accidentally clicked on the paper and oh okay yes oh. um Oh, cancel. Never mind. I found it. Okay. So, open up the file folder. Yeah, open up the file and then go to the file uh, Python Roomba level zero dot pi. Or sorry, <laughs> just Roomba level zero dot pi. Cool. So. Um, so here's the file. Let me clean up the white space. So we need to use uh, those commands that we saw here. So those commands that we saw were um, forward, oops, forward distance, and then backward distance um, right angle and left angle so I'm typing here this this part of the code um, oh am I screen sharing I am do you see my yes. screen yes okay so this part of the code here um, is a comment so it's it's not actually code that, that the computer does anything with. Um, these are not and directions for the computer to follow. These are comments that humans leave for other humans. And um, you signified that through the ha hashtag everything? at the beginning. Yeah, hashtag, yeah. Yeah. So okay. Uh, hold down shift and hit three on most keyboards uh, in the United yeah. States layout. <laughs> I don't know okay. about other layouts. Um, Actually, I know for sure that's not that in other layouts. Um, so, in in some other layouts, anyway, um, it's hard to be precise uh, and f accurate in all all cases. Okay, so we should be able to type forward and then forty, and uh, so the the distance here in forward is going to be a number of pixels that the the turtle will go. Okay. So if I uh, if I do just this, then the turtle will go from the place. If I do this and then I rerun the code, then the turtle will go back up to the upper left hand corner like it did originally, and then it will go the direction that it's facing forty pixels. And it's cur it's it was facing down, so it'll go yeah. down forty pixels. Okay. Um, so you need to put. 40 uh, before 
this line that says window dot exit on click. Oh, uh, okay. In between the lines where it says start your code here and end your code here. Um, actually, let me turn on line numbers. So around line 22. Yeah, you can put it there. Um, but you do need to not have a space at the very beginning. Um, so the the uh, that line, go ahead and move it. It's not a huge deal, but move it in in between the the place where it says start your code here and end your code here. So above, oh. yeah, and then go to the there, yeah. And there's a space there, so you'll have to get rid of the space at the beginning of the line. Yeah. Um, and then, yeah, so forward, open parenthesis, 40, close parenthesis. OK, now do, um, we're going to do uh, some fancy stuff. We're going to make it so that you are able to see the code and the shell at the same time. Ooh. So do Control X. Um, <laughs> uh, what is undo in Emacs? Oh, okay. Command Z, I guess, works um, on, a, on Mac OS. So Control G will make it so that you're not Control G, not, uh, not Control S. Hit Control G. Okay, and then do can hold down Control and tap X, and then let go of X, and then let go of Control. Uh, so I'll do the same. Yeah. So oh, you did it twice. Uh, so do Control G. Okay, and then do Control X just once, and then hit the number two. Now do control X and then hit B and then hit enter. So now you're back to the shell. Um, go ahead and close the window with the turtle and that should bring you back to the shell. Okay, cool. And now do uh, type Python space Roomba underscore level zero, oops, zero dot Do I type y. it here? Yes. Python space, yeah, Roomba underscore level zero dot pi. <laughs> dot poo. <laughs> oh, no. And then hit enter. And did it uh, show the turtle draw a line? No, a he just spun. Really? Oh, uh, I forgot to save. So click on the lower half, uh, down where it says exit on click. Yeah, down there. Any Anywhere in the lower half. So click down there. Yeah. And then uh, hit the... I think maybe you can do Command S for save on a Mac. Yes, you can. OK, so go ahead and close the turtle window. And then go back to the upper half and uh, type Python space Roomba level 0 dot pi again. Should I leave it there or where sh should I type it again? Uh, click. Oh, never mind. He did it. Oh, that's cool. Uh, so you just clicked, oh, look at that. That's cool. So you can just click on that, good to know. Little zero dot pi. And it draws a little line. I'm gonna share my screen so that that's visible. Uh, where is the turtle? What am I looking for? Python turtle graphics. Python turtle graphics. Allow. So there it, there, is. it drew yep, a line from one box to the next. Okay. Yep. 